Good morning, YouTube. My name Proto Goomba. You can call me Proto. Welcome to Portal Revolution. I've never heard of this. I didn't know it was coming out, but Portal is my shit. So I'm about to start with chapter one. If I can go ahead and hit play. Uh, I am the GOAT at Portal 1 and 2. Like, I, I, don't, I don't think there's a better player than me. So this is a fan mod, it's not actually created by Val. Good morning, test subject. You have been in suspension for 72 days. The Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center congratulates you on your 36 year sleep anniversary. You have been selected as a potential candidate for our Human Emergency Response Team. Please review the agreement provided on the nearby monitor. To me, I can see myself. To be accepted into the Human Emergency Response Team, you will now participate in an advanced difficulty testing track where your problem-solving skills, athleticism, and response to increasingly hazardous conditions will be evaluated. Please press the button to accept the terms. Oh, this monitor. You want me to press that? Thank you for volunteering. The door will open in three, two, one. Look at this place. Okay. <laughs> like a real aperture. Like. I remember playing community mods back in the uh, community testing back in the day. It was a lot of fun. back there that I missed. Sometimes my gamer intuition takes me to big Test subjects may experience symptoms of mental defects after long-term chemically induced hibernation. You will now participate in a brain damage evaluation survey to determine just how damaged your brain is. If you believe your brain is sufficiently operational, press the button in front of you and continue the test. Very good. Please walk through the portal and continue testing. No. Your self-reported status is more than sufficient for testing. I'm supposed to be taunting. As I was saying, you're not funny. You're nothing compared to her. You'll never be anything compared to her. You couldn't even fathom being anything. Who is her? You're at. Please be advised that noticeable damage to eyesight is not part of any test protocols, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grill, which in semi-rare cases may emancipate some of the light-sensing rods and cones inside your head. I'd like to repeat yourself, and you're talking nonsense. Who are you? You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. As a candidate for the Human Emergency Response Team, you are expected to adapt to all dangerous situations and as such will not be informed about the device's safety hazards.
I didn't hear. I wasn't listening to you. I just tuned you out, buddy. Um, yeah, Glados is much better, funnier, quippier, cooler, smarter, and I don't even know what you look like. So, and Wheatley was in. Your performance in the next test chamber will be time to measure puzzle solving and execution speed during extreme wind and weather conditions. In the rare case that wind and weather conditions appear to be ordinary, please stay idle in the entrance foyer until the desired conditions are met. Congratulations, test subject number one. You have set the world record for this exercise and now officially hold first and last place on the leaderboard. No Easter egg? No? You can't even drop little hints like GLaDOS. You ain't. You, you're a punk. I understand the game just started, but. Okay, what do we have here? What? Now I gotta finish talking. The next test may contain concentrated amounts of electromagnetic radiation that may be harmful to the retinas Maybe. of some humans. The Enrichment Center recommends to solve this test with closed eyes, as health insurance will not be provided for this specific exercise. In case the light-sensing rods and cones of your eyes have previously been emancipated by an emancipation grill, feel free to ignore the prior warning. This guy's home, speech, the way he talks, I don't know. He's really, really grinding my feet. Times over, and I just don't get it. I, don't, I didn't have to do that. I don't know why. But... Mm. Yeah. And what, what do you got to say? Next? You have completed the test. If you have not done so already, you are permitted to open your eyes. Before starting with the next test chamber, we would like to remind you that, so far, no experiment has yet unproven whether or not weighted storage cubes are not incapable of not feeling pain when being emancipated. You are really getting good at pissing me off, pal. This is not gonna be how this video goes. That's not what we're doing. Ooh, now you got me doing it. Expand your vocabulary. You're supposed to be smart. Read a book. Read.
inside this little plastic. Where's my other? I need another portal. Can't ha can't have a portalless. No. What am I supposed to do here? Bug something out. Now nah, this has got to be a bug or something. This is. How do I? What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? successfully solved five test chambers. To ensure a high quality of human resources, the following test chambers may include elements of danger. Extra caution is advised. Good luck. Center, I wish to apologize about the current state of our testing facility. Due to technical difficulties, we are unable to provide an experience of suitable quality at this time. You didn't repeat what you, you didn't repeat your words this time. I'm proud of you. I'm so proud. I think we might be able to get past our difficulties.
tablespoon baking soda. Volatile organic compounds. What are teaspoon baking powders? Ethanol benzene. Am I about to like get put on a lit chocolate chips? Is this a cookie recipe? And licorice. Okay. I'm not gonna get stuck reading that, but more 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 recipes. I don't I don't understand, but okay. It's just a cookie recipe. <laughs> Wait. It's a cake recipe. As a consequence of semi-recent events, some aerial faith plates could be misconfigured and launch objects into arbitrary directions. Be careful. Oh, this thing. Hello. Oh. Well, that's definitely wrong. Oh, do it again. Give me a second. Go again. Go again. Go again. Go again. 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 There. Try that. Uh, you just had to spoil the fire. Good. That faith plate is now properly calibrated. Oh. So that's why there are holes in the ceiling. Okay. Thank you, game. More lore, more lore, more lore. I stop reading into it too hard. Let's let's figure out how to do this uh, this chamber. We'll call this the last chamber. Actually, we'll leave the chambers here, and I'll pick up in the next episode. If you want to see more, let me know. If not, maybe this will be all you see. Until then, peace out, homie.